Welcome to IBC 2024. Discover game-changing innovations, explore new business models, and network with over 170 countries right here in Amsterdam. Well, we're here at the IBC in Amsterdam and we're joining Laird now and uh, Chris is here from Laird. How's it all going for you? Are you enjoying it? Yeah, perfect. It's a fantastic time to be here back at, uh, at IBC here in Amsterdam, showcasing our latest products for the broadcast uh, industry and XR stages, so fantastic to be here. So tell us more about those products and what you're actually doing in the industry right now. Yeah, so uh, as Layard and Planar, we manufacture uh, LED video walls, direct view LED walls, which is nowadays a standard in uh, broadcast and XR stages. And we make fine pixel pitch solutions like the one that we see here behind us um, to create those stages, to set those stages, to allow dynamic content to be shown on it and perfect on-camera capture. Yeah, and it's brilliant at something like this to to advertise and market your product because it just looks fantastic. Yeah, indeed. And we teamed up here together with uh, with Zero Density, um, actually showing towards uh, our customers what it can be to have an end-to-end -end solution, going from content creation to dynamically adjusting it on the screen to perfect camera capturing. So it's the whole workflow that we try to demonstrate here towards our customers. And what are the trends in the industry right now as regards screens and monitors? What are you doing that's different? Yeah, but the trend is already a long time ongoing for direct view LED. Uh, so uh, it's still, you have two next to each other. You have a green key solution or an LED solution as a backdrop. But you see that most of the studios, smaller studios, are going for a dynamic wall to easily and adjust their contact. Uh, and a direct view LED wall is that ideal. Second trend that we are seeing is the pixel pitch, so the, the, the resolution of a wall that is going down and down, um, mainly because you can then be closer to your wall to be more interactive with that, uh, with that content. Yeah, everything just feels so immersive yes. and so exciting. Yeah, indeed, fully exciting. And here also, we can show an immersive screen with additional uh, set extensions and everything like that, so fully immerse your viewers on into the display. I mean, when you're thinking of the future now, where do we go next? Yeah, it's really hard to tell. Um, I think other, I would say more trends like more going to 4K or more uh, going to what is called ST2110 is more like how the content is getting delivered to the screen and the processing is where we see the most evolution ongoing. Um, the screen on itself, I would say it's quite stable. We have here and there some features that are added like HDR, but it's more the content how it's done or delivered and the processing side that is evolving uh, over the time. And of course there are multiple uses. This isn't only you know restricted to the media and broadcast industry. Yeah correct. So those screens we not only use them in broadcast uh, because of those features we can also use them in control rooms, corporate environments, enterprise environments, even retail. So the yeah, you can use them everywhere, I would say, in terms of when you want to display something. Yeah, absolutely. Every industry turns into a whole presentation and a Correct. whole creative yeah. process. Yeah, uh, immersive, engaging uh, viewers is the, is the new uh, trend. Absolutely. Well, Chris, I'll let you get back to the show. It's so busy on the stand yes. and good luck. Thank you very much.